Well, as I do, I live and breathe, it's Freddie Smith himself. How Hello there, Peter. How are you? <laughs> you sound very chirpy, Fred. I am. I've got a new watch. A new watch? Yeah. And uh, who gave you that, or did you buy it yourself? I actually bought it out of the swindled benefits. Swindle benefits that you uh, swindle from the state. Indeed. We both swindle from the state. Yes. In case no one, someone's not been listening. Yeah, we benefit for us. <laughs> yes, keep up, keep up, audience. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. So, background information. We benefit for us. And so right. you, 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 be careful of the fourth wall there, Peter. <laughs> <laughs> Given this is a cod past, I don't think there's even a second wall. But anyway, enough of this gay banter. Uh, you got a new watch. Very nice. Can I have a look at it? Yeah, there you go. Oh, it's one of those 1980s digital ones. Yes, I, this is my first digital watch. Oh, can I? Oh, it's only got one button, and that, that's a light. And let's have a look. Oh, so you've got one button, and it's a light. Well, if you press it three times, it goes into a different mode, I believe. Well, there you go then. I'm sorry, Fred. Oh, oh, that's not very good. This, this must have been cheap. It must have been from... There's strings everywhere. <laughs> oh, cheaper than I thought, Peter. <laughs> Where did you buy it? <laughs> I bought it from 50p land. 50p land? Yes. Is that across the world from 25p land? <laughs> <laughs> it is, Peter. <laughs> from the corner from 12.5p land. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and so on and so forth for all you math geeks. <laughs> so, 50p land. I'll tell you what, it's it's not half the shot that a pound land is. <laughs> or actually it is, it's just half, exactly. We have to adjust for inflation. <laughs> yeah, because, uh, yeah, you do. <laughs> I was going to say something really witty, but then I realised the extent of my wit had been exhausted. You'd exhausted it. So, this watch, not... I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be honest, Fred. I'm gonna be honest. It's not the best watch I've ever seen. Well, it isn't now. It's, 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 it's several it's thousand it's pieces. All over the floor. That's all the benefit office. We're 3D4, just in case people aren't listening. Um, well, I'm very sorry to, that you've uh, your watch is broke. Well, what do you think I should do now, Peter? Well, I think you need to get yourself over to six and three quarter P land. Yes. Do I have time for that, Peter? Well, that's one of the paradoxes of this whole scenario, is we can never know. How can you tell whether it's time to get a watch? You don't know until you get the watch. Exactly. It's one of the mysteries of the universe. We'll just look at the clock. That and Jimmy Savile working for BBC for so long. Well, now then, now then. Nelson Peter. Mandela's whereabouts eternally. Um, Winnie Mandela. What about her? Lovely lady. Yes, she is. Did she work for Quick Fit? You can't get quicker than quick, quick. <laughs> I can't imagine her in those she walls. Get, she got tired of it. Burning tire around someone's neck. Oh, no, let's not talk about that. That's all in the past now. Don't talk about that. Or Stephen Hawking. Oh, how is the he, Peter? The size of the universe is in rust to my voice, Brox. <laughs> I heard he was going on tour, Peter. <laughs> <laughs> what, interdimensionally tour? Interdimensionally on tour. He's gone to another like well. Yes. He's been sucked into a black hole of some sort in outer darkness where there's much gnashing and waning of teeth. Uh, 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 uh. Well, you know what his last words were, don't you? Diddly 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 doo. Oh. Yeah, they're thinking uh, if he's a saint, they're going to. Um, Exhume his remains or reboot him. <laughs> Apparently, that's all that was needed. He wasn't really telling you, he just needed to switch you on and off again. That works with most of these devices. Oh, I see, Peter. So his tour's cancelled then? I think it was, was cancelled as soon as we went. They should switch it back on. It always works with my computer. Indeed. Well, I don't think I've got time to rent this watch now. The benefits office is opening up yeah, to us. Yeah, job centre's open. Time for a lot more free lolly that the British state gives out to good-for-nothings like us. Indeed. 
It's time for some deformment. <laughs> You're hernia. Yes. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to be personal. <laughs> you sound like you in some pain. Oh. <laughs> do you, should I do the Heimlich maneuver on you? Oh. 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 Look, look, I know that wasn't a completely orthodox one, but I'm, I've got a marker pen in my pocket, so uh, you might have um, felt something uh, up against you. But um, let's go in. Yes, but he's a... Are you okay, mate? Do you, do you need another under the Stockholm Syndrome and mean Heinrich manoeuvre? <laughs> no, please not another Heinrich manoeuvre or whatever. Right then. Right then, I suppose uh, we'll go in there now and see you, Fred. Uh, see you, Peter. Sorry about the watch. Oh. Oh, you, you're, in a, you're in a heart attack. <laughs> uh, sorry about the watch and the hernia. Any cardiac problems that you might be experiencing presently? Hang on, is Stephen Hawking dead? <laughs> Only figuratively speaking. He's passed into um, the netherworld. Not the netherworld, as in hell, but more, um, he's passed into the, uh, what was it? That Ooh. horizontal, that horizontal point beyond the Bing Bang. <laughs> the great wheelchair in the sky. <laughs> Darwin was right. Uh, <laughs> see you, Fred. Bye, Peter. <laughs> <laughs>